the lines in three, two, one, go. In this match, we see four robots ex exiting out of HAB level two, two per side of the field during the sandstorm. On the Red Alliance, we see that Sty Pulse has apparently dropped off their initial hatch panel, and now they go back to the feeder station for a second. During Sandstorm, the Red Alliance sealed up both cargo pods in the Red Alliance cargo ship. Now cargo coming on in to that cargo ship. There's only five bays left already. Plenty of match remaining. Red Alliance leads, but not by much. Four points separate red from blue. Checking out the blue side of the field, Eidos Dios, they're deploying cargo for the Blue Alliance. They drop it off very quickly, adding three points to that Blue Alliance score. They're partners in Blue Bumpers, Birchbots, 54-21. They have some cargo of their own. They raise their elevator, realizing they are slightly misaligned, and now they drop off that cargo, unfortunately, into a bay where there was already cargo placed by their Alliance partners from Manchester, Connecticut. Robo Panthers in red bumpers, they have been sent down to be the defensive bot on behalf of the red number four alliance. They're trying to stick to Atos Dios, who managed to drop some cargo for three points once again for blue. Their partners right behind them on the other side of the ship, Birch Bots, with three cargo points of their own. It looks like the Red Alliance is shifting their focus to a rocket. That reasoning might be that there are only two null hatch panels left without cargo in them on the red side of the field. Panels going up on that rocket are an easy two points at a time. And when you have a robot that is as strong at hatch panels as some of these robots are, it's better to focus on those quick two points than try to navigate cargo into that cargo ship. One cargo pod remaining, Stipulse bringing it up for the Red Alliance. Instead of going for the ship, they move over to a rocket. That's going to allow them to navigate the defense from stem whalers in blue bumpers. 30 seconds remaining, Red Alliance lead 56 to 43. The Blue Alliance needs to make sure they get as many HAB climb points as possible in Birch Bots in Blue Bumpers. They are up on HAB level two, but they need to be careful about where the robot support is coming from in the HAB. Their partners, Stem Whalers, are lifting themselves up onto level two as well. Their last partner, Atos Dios, already parked on the BC dot, but we've got a double level three climb from Stipulse and their partners in red. 